Sarah Ashley Kirshner, future Mrs. Marcel. Before I met you, I did not know just how selfish I was. Now I can see. As your husband, I vow to put your needs in front of mine, to love you and hold you when you are strong and when you are weak. Before I met you, I did not know just how much I spoke. Now I can hear. I promise to invest more into our communication than anything else that I have ever done. Before I met you, I did not know just how uncommitted I was. Now I have something special to be committed to. I promise to always be faithful to you and to cherish you as my wife. I vow to always provide a home for us, to keep us warm and protected. I vow to take you out on dates and make you feel like the queen that you are every day, even when we are apart. I promise to support your creative pursuits, even if I am just an ear to talk into and a shoulder to lean on. I commit to loving you forever. Elliot, my dearest, my life, you are something so special. You are the warmest and sweetest soul. You are truly the nicest and the kindest person I have ever met. Your love is so unbelievable and you are so caring. I am honored and so blessed that I get to spend the remainder of my days with you by my side. Our life we have built together and will continue to build together is something of dedication, dreams, hard work, and magic. We have had our share of adventures, and I know our life will be one built of wonder. A life built of adventure. That's you and me, babe. An experience I know that neither of us will take for granted. To walk side by side, to help each other through the tough times, to sing the song that calms the storm, and to know when to leave the second down blanket behind on an eight day hike. <laughs> and to push, to strengthen, and above all, to continue moving forward to uncharted paths together. To experience all of life by your side will be one of my biggest blessings yet. Your look, your outlook and positive attitude are something to be admired and sometimes questioned for just how positive. <laughs> for just at the end of a long day or any day at all, hearing your voice or being held in your arms is the only that I need and want to make my day better and brighter. You are my home, my comfort, my best friend, and I vow to cherish what we have for all of the days of my life.